I can't wait for all the like serious Marvel fans to make fun of me. What's that? Your temporal aura. What's that? Please give it <laughs> What? <laughs> Why? I said it's slow mo, but it's so funny. Sign this too. I beg your pardon? What? How? Um, hello? Is it... Oh. Hi. Um, hi. Hello. My name is Danielle, and today we're gonna be starting a new reaction series. And we're gonna be reacting to Loki episode one, which just came out today. I've heard a lot of good things about it from people that have got to see it earlier. Extremely jealous of them. But I don't really know what to expect from this show. I've seen the trailer once, I think, and I didn't... I don't remember it, honestly. I know Owen Wilson is in it, which is wild to me. So I'm kind of going in blind and I'm very excited about that. But before we get started, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and you can turn on the notification bell to get notified every time I post a new video and you can give this video a like and you can follow me on all my social medias down below. There's no way to make that less annoying for me. So I'm gonna annoy you as well while I do it. <laughs> if you've been here since my past reaction series, welcome back. I hope you are okay with me doing this one. I know I asked before and I got a lot of awesome responses, but the show just came out and it was like brand new and I'm very excited to watch it. I have been a long time Marvel fan since like Iron Man era. Um, gosh, those movies are good. And I actually do have a Marvel reaction series on my channel. You can watch it if you want but it's not my best work. I was new to reacting to things and I just didn't go about it very well, so it's kind of random, but it's fun. It's funny if you wanna watch them. I'll link them right there. I have not yet watched Falcon and Winter Soldier, um, but otherwise I've pretty much seen all the other Marvel movies, except for, I think Spider-Man 2 is the only one I haven't seen, but I'm hoping that those will not really be applicable here. I can't wait for all the like serious Marvel fans to make fun of me. But anyway, let's get into this. Today we're gonna be reacting to season one, episode one, which is called Glorious Purpose and it's 51 minutes long. <laughs> Holy cow. Let's stop talking. Let's get into the show. This is, it's not on Netflix. Hit Netflix, you stupid. It's on Disney Plus. We're shaking it up a little. Stupid headphones. Let's go. Okay, shut up. New York City. All right, we love to see it. Oh, okay. On my way down to coordinate search and rescue. On my way down to coordinate search and rescue. Maximum occupancy has been reached. Take the steps. All right, hold on. I gotta pause. I have seen this scene before. I don't know if it was in the original Avengers, but maybe it was like an extended scene or something. I don't know. But anyway, my subtitles are on it. And I thought it was the funniest thing because it said 2012 Stark, 2012 Loki. Is that necessary? It's kind of weird. Anyway. I, yeah, I've seen this before, but it's confusing. Ooh, it's green. I'm really racking my brain right now, trying to think of what that clip was from and like where we are in the storyline. And I cannot figure it out for the life of me. So I'm hoping, I don't know. I'm hoping for explanation. This is why I don't like starting TV shows because like I have to know everything at once when we don't know things. I ask a lot of questions, even though they'll probably be answered, but yep. So we're still on earth. Oh, he looks so different. How the hell? What? <laughs> Why? I said it's slow mo, but it's so funny. Oh! Moving at one sixteenth speed. Whoa! This is wild. This office feels very seventies. Hello, ma'am. Love, this is evidence. I love him. Can you at least tell me what it is? It's a tesseract. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Tom Hiddleston. But also that sucks. Oh, okay. What 
is going on? Verify this is everything you've ever said. What? Sign this too. I don't know how I'm gonna cut this down at all because this is all hilarious and insane. Please confirm to your knowledge that you are not a fully robotic being. What if I was a robot and I didn't know it? The machine would melt you from the inside out. Please move along. What's that? Your temporal aura. What's that? <laughs> take A. Take it. Well, I guess it doesn't matter that much if the other guy didn't take it. This is a mistake. I shouldn't be here. Hi there. You're probably saying, this is a mistake. I shouldn't even be here. But sometimes people like you. Oh my gosh, I love this. Created, stepping off your path created a nexus event, which left unchecked. When did Loki do all this? This is very reminiscent of like the Jetsons cartoon or something. I love it. Weird. Don't hesitate to let us know how we're doing. <laughs> Somebody got the jump on him. Oh, we will see. You. How is this not interfering with the timeline? I only came into possession of the Tesseract because they traveled through time. No doubt in a last ditch effort to stave off my ascent to God King. Where you can smell the cologne of two Tony Stark. <laughs> Guilty. All of this. <laughs> I'm surprised that's the first time he's tried since he got there. Don't rush me. And I sent it to you to be reset. Next case, please. Reset. What does that mean? What does that is it bad? Yeah, what does that mean? You have no idea what I'm capable of. I I think I might. <laughs> I feel like I'm always looking up to you. I like it. It's appropriate. Okay. Very cool. Very Jetsons esque. <laughs> Wait, so how does all this work? No particularly dangerous variants. You're just a little pussycat. Intrigue. There's a fork in every road. Get the wrong path. Always taken. Good. Yeah. <laughs> Makes you sound super smart. I am smart. <laughs> I know. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> I like this dynamic so far. Yes, let's get a recap, please. Oh yeah, Phil Coulson. <laughs> that was sad. Ooh, okay, weird. I just realized that I need to be like over here. Fuck, I don't, I haven't done this in a while. Am I, I'm, for real wondering if I'm being an idiot right now for I just do not understand what's going on. I was just standing up to make a point. I'm sorry, go ahead. It won't be as meaningful now. Okay, well, stay seated. I'll do what I want to do. Sure. <laughs> and when I do, it'll be because I did it. Not because it was supposed to happen. This is quite the mind f Just the concept of everything. It's very meta, I feel like. It would have been taken to a cell on Asgard. Oh, okay. They, so they can see it in the future. Like how things are supposed to go. This is weird. We know your whole life how it's all meant to be. So then how are you able to deviate? <laughs> Natasha. <laughs> what a cry. I think we can finish up tomorrow and just pick it up. How? How? Was it really that easy? Yeah, you left the thing on the table. Get that criminal with the blue box. Oh, yay. Oh, give me the Tesseract or I'll gut you like a fish, Casey. What's a fish? <laughs> What's a fish? What else is in there? What? <gasps> Infinity stones? Right. No way. Some of the guys use them as paperweights. How the hell? Is this the greatest power in the universe? <laughs> Uh, yeah, could be argued. What is he doing? Oh, oh no. Curiosity killed the cat, man. I love you, my sons. No, oh, that's a rough one, too. How is any of this gonna happen now, though?
That's <laughs> that's gotta be psychologically traumatic. How did he know how to do that? Okay. <laughs> oh my god, stop. I can't go back, can I? What do you mean you can't go back? Isn't that the idea? Don't they need him to go back? I'm so good It's part of the illusion. Mm -hmm. You, you just described yourself. a villain. Yeah. A villain. <laughs> you need the god of mischief to help you stop them. That's right. The variant we're hunting is you. I beg your pardon? What? How? What? In what time? Like, when did he become a variant that time? What? Wait. Time signature is early third millennium. Definitely anachronistic. I don't know what any of those words mean, but okay. Oh, man. Oh, that's the end. I'm so confused. So, let's talk about it. I don't even know what I'm going to say, honestly, because I'm... I have so many questions and I'm so lost, but I don't see a point in asking them because I'm not going to get an answer until I get to see more of it, and there, there's only one episode out so far, so. But that's also kind of how I felt after the first episode of WandaVision, or I guess like the first two episodes of WandaVision, so I'm just trying to take it with a grain of salt and accept the fact that I have no f idea what's going on right now. <laughs> that was definitely a good setup and I feel like they laid the groundwork for something that could be good. I hope that they came up with justifications and explanations for things that will logically make sense because that's where things get really interesting. This has the potential for a lot of loopholes I feel like <laughs> so I hope that that doesn't happen but I have a feeling with Marvel it's not gonna happen. I don't know what to say. I really liked Loki in this. Owen Wilson I need to see more of. I definitely want a background on like what exactly his position is there and his ranking because I couldn't really tell in that. We do know he's searching for Loki now though which is weird. It's just so strange. Like the concept that they'll probably talk about this and how like well how does anyone have a choice in life but just the concept of he has this whole life that's all literally mapped out and then somehow he deviates from it which like if it's mapped out how does he deviate from it and if he does deviate from it how does how, how does anyone stay on their registered path or whatever <sighs> that just that literally hurts my brain to think about and i don't want to think about it <laughs> it was good it was funny a lot of funny moments interesting setup and i'm very curious to see where they take it also like why would loki be hunting minutemen i'm i think that's what they're called i don't know because to me at this point it seems like he's messing with the timelines just so the minutemen will come so he can kill them so basically he's like seeking them out and hunting them and killing them why though because based on this whole backstory that we've gotten so far of what the tva is and how big they are and how vast their numbers are it just kind of seems like he's killing off four or five at a time and to what end weird i don't know but i'm very excited to see where it goes from here i think i will definitely continue reacting to this series my shoulder hurts so i'm just gonna make like some funny poses so that's gonna be it for this video today make sure you like and subscribe follow me on all social media down below i'll have more videos coming out soon and a new one of this next week probably see you in the next one bye Thank you.